This is an example shot from the video encyclopedia of pool shots, a 5 DVD series covering over 750 shots in 50 different categories. This example is from disc 2, which covers all of the topics shown here. Now let's look at several common ball tracks that take you through the center of the table. Anything roughly 45 degrees into the short rail brings you close to the center of the table. Here Tom's shooting with follow through the second diamond on the long and short rails. Here if we stun off the 11 ball shot, the cue ball will head into the short rail at about 45 degrees and we'll end up with center of table position. Here we need follow to get as close to the 45 degree track to the center. Here we need a slight amount of draw. Routes through the center of the table can be very useful when playing position. As we've seen, one reason is that you won't scratch. Another good reason is that running English off the first long rail will look like reverse English off the second long rail, and this helps kill the cue ball's motion at the end of the shot. Let's look at several examples where a position route through the center of the table is the right play. Once you're comfortable sending the cue ball through the center of the table, it's easy to make adjustments relative to that line. Here the tangent line heads into the short rail at about 45 degrees, so a stun shot will take us through the center of the table. So if we wanted to avoid the obstacle balls on the short side, we would use a little bit of draw. And to avoid the obstacle balls on the long side, we just have to use a little bit of follow. Once you have confidence in your center of table routes, you can trust it, even if you only have a small window to navigate through. For more information on the entire series, visit dr-dave-billiards.com. There you can view video highlights and complete list of shots from all five discs.